XRP Army. Real quick, I saw something that is very important for the Ripple versus SEC lawsuit. And you have to watch this all the way through to understand what's happening with this lawsuit. And real quick, we're in Thailand and I'm making y'all this video at six o'clock in the morning. I just woke up, I don't know if you can tell, but this is really important. And you need to take action with this video. Share this with anyone that you know that holds XRP, anyone that's interested in crypto, let them see for themselves that this is a witch hunt. What is happening with Ripple versus the SEC? Like, it is not fair whatsoever. Like, how can XRP be a security and then Ethereum is not a security? And watch this video to see exactly why it is a witch hunt, why the SEC is going after XRP very unfairly and destroy the like button, subscribe to this channel so the algorithm pushes this video out. Literally everyone that holds XRP in the world needs to see this video right now. So do your part like I'm doing mine and let's just jump into it. So this right here is Ripple XRP. This is what we're going to speak about right now. And this right here is a Twitter thread that we're going to go into detail. So I'm going to spend a couple minutes explaining why this lawsuit against Ripple XRP is literally a witch hunt and why it could go into 2023 and why you should not believe what is happening with this lawsuit, why you should still stay invested in XRP. Now, this is not financial advice, but real quick, shout out to Crypto Law for this Twitter thread. Again, we're gonna spend a couple minutes real quick and destroy the like button, subscribe to this channel if you have not yet already, and let's just jump into it. So in 2018, a SEC Director of Corporate Finance, William Hinman, reported receiving $3.4 million from this consulting firm, which is a member of the Enterprise Ethereum Alliance, an organization dedicated to promoting Ethereum. And right here, as you can tell, that consulting firm sent Mr. Hinman over $1.5 million, about actually about over $3 million, so two different payments in 2018. So that's not shady at all. There, there's nothing to look, nothing to see there, okay? Nothing important. And then in that same year, that SEC director and his staff met repeatedly with top investors and business promoters of Ethereum before he delivered a speech declaring that Ether is not a security. So again, that's not fishy. That doesn't, you know, there's no connection. There's no connection between this $3.4 million payment and Hinman saying that Ethereum is not a security. There's nothing to see there, right? Let's keep going. Now, the SEC is fighting tooth and nail in federal court to hide drafts of the Hinman speech because they know they're in trouble. The SEC knows that they're in trouble if this report comes out and the SEC emails that were attached. Basically, this will clarify that Hinman is acting shady. There is something that he's doing behind the scenes and it's obvious. That is why the SEC is hiding this. And the SEC is also fighting to prevent the identification of Hinman's clients who met with him at the SEC while the law firm was paying him a total of over $15 million over the four years he was in office. And here, you can pause this screen real quick and read this for yourself. This goes into more details about that payment and about what is happening. Also, the SEC is not giving the information that we are requesting, the XRP army, like all of us, we have millions of people that are requesting documents and information from the SEC because the SEC, remember, the SEC's main job is to protect investors. So us, the XRP investors are asking for proof that, hey, you are trying to protect us. You're not just trying to line up your pockets and they're not giving us no information. So. It is a witch hunt, it is bullshit, literally bullshit. And I don't like cussing, but the SEC literally is pissing me off. Anyways, let's keep going. Now, what is the SEC hiding? Only the US Congress has oversight power over the SEC. So now what can you do about it? If you are in the United States, I will leave a link to this right here. You can basically demand that the SEC gives us this information. And if a lot of us do this, if a lot of us fill out this form right here, 
they honestly will have no choice but to eventually give in. And if you do not live in the United States, I will also leave a link to something that you can sign as a petition to Congress so we get more information. Because again, Congress is the only body of power that has oversight of the SEC. So we have to petition to Congress, us, the XRP army, because unfortunately, we have no other voice because the SEC is literally being paid by Ethereum Alliance. Like the SEC right here in front of your face, the SEC was getting paid millions of dollars by consulting firms that were connected with the Ethereum Alliance. Like this is all the proof you need to see right here. This is everything you need to see. And you should agree that what is happening with the XRP lawsuit is literal bullshit. If XRP is a security, then so is Ethereum, and so is Bitcoin, and so is Dogecoin, and so is Cardano. So if you own XRP, this video definitely is one of the most important things you will see all month, if not all year. So again, share this video right now and let people see why they should invest in XRP. I know there's a lot of like there's no clarity right now there's a lot of fud being spread about this xrp but eventually once a clarity is provided we will go up to the moon <laughs> so that is why what is happening with this lawsuit is not fair whatsoever like it literally pisses me off and that is why i talk about xrp we speak about ripple and xrp on this channel every single day because it is the biggest lawsuit it is the biggest thing happening right now in crypto and the most important thing actually the most important thing that's happening in crypto right now around the world is this lawsuit so again do your part let more people see this video right now by destroying the like button and jo joining us on this channel because if you hold xrp or if you do not either way this lawsuit will affect you. What happens with this XRP lawsuit will definitely affect your holdings, whether you hold XRP or not. So share this video with everyone. And until next time, I will see y'all very soon. Y'all know what it is. Mr. Mufleh, out.